vegetative propagation different methods of asexual reproduction are vegetative propagation budding fragmentation and spore formation let's discuss about them in detail one by one when new plants are produced from the vegetative parts of a plant the process is called vegetative propagation it does not involve formation of seeds let us see how vegetative propagation works stem as a vegetative part of a plant have you ever seen buds at the nodes of the stem these buds are called axillary buds these buds do not produce flower rather they give rise to new branches in some plants like rose small portions of the stem containing small nodes are cut from the plant these cut portions are called cuttings these cuttings if planted and watered can produce new rose plants similarly stem cuttings of sugarcane can also be used for vegetative propagation of sugarcane do you know potato is the edible stem of a plant it bears small scars on it called eyes well these are the axillary buds each eye on a potato can give rise to new plants by forming shoot above and root below leaf as a vegetative part of a plant in plants like bryophyllum leaf is the vegetative structure that helps in vegetative propagation of a plant many small buds arising at the margins of the leaves under suitable conditions form new plants